The long dark days of winter can affect not only humans but our canine companions as well. Seasonal affective disorder can replicate in our dogs and we may be seeing symptoms such as tiredness, lethargy or a complete reluctance to go outside altogether. Dogs by nature love to be outside in natural daylight, playing in the mud, getting their paws dirty. But the trouble is at this time of year is that it's wet, it's cold and pretty miserable. Good lad. My main advice is just to get out with your dog. Come on. Keep your walks fun and playful. Get it. Fetch it. Over. It's a clever boy. Regardless of the size or shape of the garden, it can offer a lovely environment for you to get out and give your dog some natural daylight. Great activities for a larger garden include kicking the football or maybe doing some mini agility with your dogs. Over, good lad. For a smaller city garden, why not try games such as find it, blowing bubbles, or basic training techniques. Max, here, sit, wait. Good boy. Some practical indoor tips would be to move your dog's bedding to the window, to turn up the lighting, and also to introduce a couple of fun games. Find it. Oh, good girl, come here, drop it or using a food release device to keep your dog stimulated. Nutrition can play a big part in relieving the symptoms of seasonal affective disorder in dogs. Poor diet can be linked to lethargy and depression within canines, and eating poor quality dog food or even our leftovers may lead to an increase in behaviour problems and isn't good for your dog's overall health. Okay. A healthy diet, free from artificial colourings, flavouring or preservatives, is absolutely essential. 